So G Mom Kim says, do high value men get turned off if the woman pursues them instead if waiting for them to be pursued? Well, you can you can reach out to men. Just because you send a man a text message or a message doesn't mean that you're like chasing him or pursuing him. You like chasing him and pursuing him is like having a goal associated with it, right? If you're like, hey, I feel like I need connection and you reach out to him and you're kind of coming from this feminine space and you're just like, hey, you know, like I was thinking about you, that's not necessarily, like that's not pursuing a man, right? Pursuing a man is like, hey, you know, like when are we gonna meet up? Like, let's chat, like, you know, trying to get something to happen based on your communication with a man and you know, trying to move things in a certain direction, that's pursuit, right? And just sending a guy a message isn't necessarily pursuit, and it's not necessarily a bad thing, depending on your situation. Now, I said this a little while ago, and somebody took it in the wrong context and sent, ended up sending a guy a message right after he was like, you know, hey, I need some space, and she was like, oh, okay, I'm gonna give you some space. And so if that's the situation, you don't wanna reach out to him, if you're like, hey, re you know, like get back to me when you know you're ready or whatever, you don't want to end up reaching out to him then because that's kind of smothering him. But if if you're just sending a guy a message, there's nothing wrong with doing that. That's not a bad thing. Like leaning back doesn't mean that you can't message a guy. 